Hello everybody, welcome back to The Sims 4 Episode 2. So we've got our roommates all together at the bottom corner here, and we have our money we can spend now. Um, I am going to be building my own house. I've done both so far. I've actually toyed around with building a house, and toyed around with putting four people in one house. And that was a terrible, terrible, terrible idea. Uh, so I'm going to go and build a house. I've already gone through the tutorial of building a house. So I'm going to kind of speed through the process. It's pretty similar to how it works in real life. So don't worry about it. Um, and then we can build in two, one of two different rooms or lands. We've got the dusty turf. We could build it here on the beach. Uh, or we could build it here in Willow Creek. I'm actually going to go build it in Willow Creek. Um, we have a place that's 2,000 and a place that's 2,500. Why the hell would I... Pick the one that's five hundred dollars more. When well, it's all the same size, it must be the neighborhood. Eh, it's fine. We'll go here. Sounds good. We'll move on in. Now we gotta build the house. That's gonna be oh man, that's gonna be the kicker, isn't it? All right, let's go ahead and load her up. Let's move in, and let's build ourselves our our little our little humble abode that we can hopefully do something with and uh, live out of for the next X amount of days, years, months, whatever. Uh, like I said, I've already gone through the major tutorial stuff. So we're just going to go straight into building mode and have ourselves a good time. So basically you have this little map here. And here we can kind of click and go anywhere we need. Uh, we can hover over and we can actually pick and buy pre-built rooms. Um, the best part is about this, say I like this room. Um, or say I only like a few things in this room. I can actually click on this and then click on the thing that I like and buy that directly. That is wicked neat, and I like that a lot. Now, I'm not going to be using these rooms for a long time. I want to build a house before I really concern myself with it. Um, but that's kind of a cool idea. I like it a lot. Uh, but we're not going to worry about that right now. We're going to go ahead and go into walls. Uh, we're going to go to the room tool. And we're just going to start building out rooms. So, for instance, uh, we need to build out a big area, right? So let's go ahead and build ourselves the main kitchen area. Or the main, like, living room. So this will be, like, the main living room. Uh, and then we can have ourselves, like, the bedroom over here. We'll have one bedroom. That's one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to have two bedrooms to start where people can kind of, like, sleep. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. Like so. I like it. Nice and easy. Uh, I'm blowing money like crazy, but it's fine. So we got the living room. We got that. Let's have, uh, like, a bathroom in the middle, I guess? We can actually sell things off, too, if we don't like how they are. We can just go delete mode or even bulldoze mode, and we can. Don't, I don't need to build stairs. Relax. Because I can just actually, like, delete this whole thing and get my money back. Let's actually go ahead and delete it. I don't like that very much. So we can just build a straight-up square room and expand. But I like this better. All right, let's try this again. Let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, I think that's good. So, living room. Then we'll kind of come off to the side here and make our kitchen. All right. I like it. I like that. All right. Let's uh, swing the camera around a bit. Okay. And we want two bedrooms, like I said. Two bedrooms. We can even do just like one. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. We'll do two. Two, three, four, five. Three, four, five. We can just do that. So that's two bedrooms. Two bedrooms, a living room, and a kitchen. And then we'll have a bathroom kind of over here. Kind of a funky looking house. Uh, but overall, I think it'll be fine. Let's go to the roofing situation and get ourselves a roof. Uh, just a triangular roof would work. I'm really cool with just having a triangular roof. Can I just, like, rotate this? Why does it have to be diagonal? It's goofy looking. What about, like... Let's do one of these. Can we have it meet in the middle? What was I using? I'm assuming I was using this. That looks... 
nothing like what I was using. In fact, let's go ahead and delete that. That looks awful. Look, these guys are going to live in at least a decent looking house, okay? What is this? What did I pick? Because it's not that. It's not that. Is it this? It ain't that. Maybe it is that. Is it this? I think it was this. Yeah, it was this. Cool. Like I said, we can kind of lower this. Um, one, two, three. All right, if we click off this, how does it look? Looks fine. Sweet. We've got ourselves a roof. I'm happy with it. I don't need stairs right now. Don't worry about stairs, all right? Let's go back to the room building. Um... Cool. Can we get... Why are we... Why are we so low right now? There we go. All right. Living room, double bedrooms, bathroom, kitchen. Right? That works for you? Works for me. Let's kind of start building it out and seeing what we can do. We got a bunch of different doors that we can choose. I like the I like the variety. I don't need anything expensive. We're already down to $16,000 um, before we even have anything running. So let's get something that looks good that'll last a while. Um, but we don't need to worry too much about it. We can get another one out in the back maybe after we're done. Just uh, an emergency exit, so to speak. Let's get some windows up and running. A lot of cool windows. Get some big windows. We could do double hung. What is this? 35, 40. Do we want to do double hung? Double hung looks kind of cool. Kind of like me. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do these. This is the bathroom. Do we want like a bathroom window? Nah, let's just do the same window all the way around. I feel like that's just a, good, a better idea. Letting some light in is always welcome. Yeah, good. All right, looks good. All right, now that that's done, uh, let's get some wallpaper. What do we want on the outside? I like, I always liked bricks, man. I did, I always liked bricks. So we could kind of like do bricks all the way around. I think that would look cool. Let's go ahead and do it. We have to do these separately because we did build them separately. Maybe the windows might end up getting changed eventually. Um, they do look kind of goofy. We might want to just raise them, I think. Just raise them up a bit. Help with the goofiness look. Like so. Uh, yeah. I must say, this game runs so smooth. I'm very happy with the kind of optimization this game has. It is freaking great. Alright, so that's done. What is this? Medium wall? Oh, we can, like, make the wall bigger? That's kind of cool. Does that do it with everything? Okay, it does. So I can do, like, a high wall, medium wall. Let's do a medium wall. So we have some sort of something to look at. All right, next up is the inside furniture, wallpaper, good stuff. So we want some paint, maybe even some wallpaper. You know, let's do the bathroom, bathroom tiles, rock and stone, all that good stuff. We don't need siding tile. So bathroom, that's just gaudy, Mathis. Sterilized. You know, that actually works. I'll take it. Uh, and then we want some paint. So the kitchen can look pretty basic. I don't need to look crazy or anything. Kind of want something to look kind of kitcheny in a way. I don't want to, I don't, again, I'm not incredibly, like, concerned about the looks of this stuff. $80. Drywall. Basic darks. We actually changed the basic darks, too, which is nice. 
So we want just like a basic dark blue or like this for our kitchen. Let's just go with that for now. Bedrooms. Um, we'll go with some wallpaper. We'll go crazy. If we could do like that. We'll, all right, let's not go that crazy. I mean, Aruba's an evil genius, but he's not gaudy, all right? Prehistoric dinosaurs? That's awesome. But not for me. Darling dinos? I mean, it's so hard to say no. It's so hard to say no. Let's get dinosaurs going in there. And in the other one, they could just have paint. All right. Whoever sleeps in this one is the boring paint room. And then the living room. We'll have it red. I like it. So we got walls and empty rooms. Floor patterns. Now, can I just, like, do that? All right. So for floors, as always, we'll do what we did before. Tile for the bathroom because it's a fucking bathroom. Um, we can even do tile for the kitchen. Rug for the living room. Carpet, whatever you want to call it. Doesn't seem to matter all that much. Living room. And then these guys can have the same kind of thing running in theirs. Bedroom. Bedroom. We do need doors in the house. So we need like some medium. You know, these, this door on the outside might want to get moved. Could even just demolish a wall. Like that. It'll light up the area nicely. Door of perception. Are you serious? It's like a hidden door? Unlocked by reaching level 10 of the writer career while on the author branch. Ooh, cool. I like it. All right, look, this is uh, the ladies. This is the bathroom, everybody, just in case you didn't know. And we'll go ahead and just crack this wall down. I like it. All right, cool. So that made that makes life easier for now. So now we got to start furnishing this place a bit. Uh, we can search straight up just by clicking, or we can go here and just kind of like click in this area. Um, again, we're gonna be doing some beds, so let's go ahead and get some beds up and running. Uh, we need two beds for each room. They're just gonna be simple beds to save us some money. So we got this bed here, and then we'll switch it up and get another different one going. This is a kind of a badass one. That belongs in here, actually, because that's just too badass. I hope that's a Roomba's evil bed. And then we'll put that one in there. And this one in there. All right, cool. Um, what else do we need? We need maybe like a nightstand or even a dresser would be good for both of us. Child's, child's dresser, enigma dresser. Thing is fucking hideous. $530. We can just like buy that. Uh, all right, you know what? Before we do dressers, let's get the stuff that we need, I guess. Um, we can go over here. Go to appliances. We got a shit refrigerator. It's a little bit more of a cooking food quality. Slightly more food quality. Sure, we'll get slightly more food quality. Uh, let's get some count. Oh, you know what? Let's get the oven in first. Okay, oven. What's over here? Trash. Why can't I not put this here? Oh, it's in the front of the fridge. Get the trash over here. What we need is a countertop now, so let's go to counters. Let's get some counters going. And we also need a sink. Which we can get a decent one. Let's see. This one's three. They're both three and three. I'm not concerned about it too much. So that's going to be that. That should be enough to go there. We could get a microwave too. Let's go ahead and get a shitty ass microwave up. Alright. I don't want one that's going to be really unreliable. I mean, for a couple hundred or more dollars, we'll get a couple more reliability points. So I'll take it. Um, 
To be honest, this room... Maybe thinking we take down the walls completely and put like a table here. That'll be what separates it almost. Mainly because we still need to get some other stuff up and running. But let's go ahead and type in... Toilet. Get the usual bathroom stuff up and running. Hygiene 5. This is uncomfortable. So another hundred and something dollars for some sort of comfort, I guess, is... I guess is worth it. Get a toilet. I'm always just going to go middle grade. I don't need anything that's, like, completely awful. At the same time, I don't want anything that's going to be completely bad. Uh, Reliability is going to win me over every time. So you can shit and talk to somebody at the same time. Let's get a sink up. Let's get a mirror up. Mirrors are good for people to practice their speeches on. Vacuum safe mirror. I'm not gonna lie, that thing's hideous. That's also not that pretty. Can we just get a basic fucking mirror? Fuck. There we go. Alright, now we need a, like a living room situation. And we need lighting too. Um. Comfort. Active and skills. Hmm. What is this recreation? Future cube by paltry. Don't make important decisions until you've consulted the future cube. That does not sound good yet. All right, desk. Let's get desks. Uh, let's get a desk up. No kid desk. We don't need a kid desk, man. The T1 fighter desk on jet engines for desk drawers. That thing's badass. Rub up your day with the stylish furniture. We can get that boring one. We can get the mega desk. I don't know, this thing's kind of fucking awesome. And by kind of fucking awesome, I mean really awesome. It's $430, $300. Screw it, man. Let's go with a chair. Let's get a cool, sweet office chair. Let's get a computer in there. So, there is a bunch of computers. I'm actually going to end up picking the mid-range one for price. We need to save the money. It's the Retrospection Mid-Range Desktop. There's all kinds of good ones later, but I'm not going to worry about those right now. I need uh, that couch or sofa, whatever works. Uh, cheap and Sleek is going to be what I want, so this could just work fine. We can get a TV up in the corner, or we can just do it like here. And then we can type in TV. And we can get like a wall-mounted TV. This one doesn't wall mount. This one does. How much? It's like three grand. We're doing it. Guys, we're going for broke here. These guys need to get jobs really quickly. Is all I'm going to say. Let's just type in sofa again and make sure I got the right one. So what did I get? Squarely there, modern sofa. That's what I got. That should work. So we've got a toilet, a bed. Uh, we got beds for everybody. What more could you guys possibly want in life? Really? Bookshelf. Book. That's going to be impo important. Not impossible, but important. So this is a five fun. It's going to be easy to, hind, uh, to hang. 175 we could just hang it right here for a little decoration or two environment five fun for a little bit more last year scientists unveiled this solution for the ultimate change this little bookshelf apparently three environment it's like a grand but it would, it would be nice let's actually just do it now that we've got all that done let's actually get some bureaus up and running Weathered Wonder Dresser. And it's kind of ugly. Oh, you know what we need? We need a friggin' fire alarm. What we need. Let's get that up. Let's not forget that. Any other essentials that I need? I don't think so. I think my house is up and running. You guys look like you're ready to live. Live your lives and enjoy yourselves. 
And I think I think I'm ready to let you. Just get a clock up. Does this give me environment? Doesn't give me anything. These give me environment. Those that doesn't. I feel like there's no point unless it gives you environment. The slab the slablet. Interesting. Alright, well, I think I'm so broke, I'm ready to let these guys live life. And that's what next episode is going to be all about. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, come back next time for some more Sims 4. And consider dropping a like as it helps me out a great deal. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.